Welcome to the Daily Writer Podcast, where we bring you tips and inspiration each day to help you build habits for writing success. For more resources, including your free Daily Writer Starter Kit, visit dailywriterlife.com. If you spend a lot of time around writers, you'll hear certain themes continue to pop up in conversations. One of those themes that I find kind of funny and entertaining is that a lot of writers blame English teachers for making them hate writing. Now, that's really too bad for a lot of reasons. And one of the reasons is that English teachers are, by and large, really wonderful people. And students who didn't do well in those English classes sometimes blame teachers for killing their writing dreams unfairly, by the way. Now, there's a lot of things wrong with this scenario, one of which is you should never give a teacher that much power over your life. That's kind of crazy. But second of all, the skills to be successful as a writer don't really have a lot to do with what you learned in English class. Nevertheless, some students look at their bad English grades and they wonder, am I cut out to be a writer? Now, this question assumes falsely, I think, that you're either born a writer or you aren't. The truth is that you're not born anything. You choose to be what you want to be. If you want to be a writer, it's completely within your power to do so. Here are some wise words from kids author R.L. Stein. People say, what advice do you have for people who want to be writers? I say they don't really need advice. They know they want to be writers and they're going to do it. Those people who know that they really want to do this and are cut out for it, they know it. So in other words, what Mr. Stein is saying here is that what makes you cut out to be a writer is the fact that you choose to do this type of work. You don't need anybody putting their mantle on you or giving you approval or giving you some kind of passing grade or an A plus or whatever. Being a writer is just something that you decide to do, no matter what anybody else thinks. So, the only question that remains is, do you want to be cut out for it? You're not born cut out for it or not cut out for it. It's a decision you make. It's a choice that you make. So, my question to you is, do you want to be a writer? And if so, you will find a way to do it. Here's today's challenge. Ask yourself honestly how badly you want to be a writer and what you're willing to give up to make room for writing in your life. A big thanks to today's sponsor, Plotter. Plotter is the number one visual book planning software for writers that helps you plan books in the same way that you think. Plotter's intuitive visual interface lets plotting be the creative process that it's supposed to be. And it's not just for fiction authors. It's also a great tool for nonfiction authors, podcasters, speakers, and anybody creating content to organize your material and story points. If you're ready to outline faster, get organized, and save loads of time in your writing, visit plotter.com to start your free 14-day trial. That's P-L-O-T-T-R dot com to start your free 14-day trial. Thanks for listening, and I'll see you next time.